Hey guys, we're back here at My Family Vacation Guide. We just got back from doing Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind. Rewind. Puking, twirling, throwing up in the dark. What nobody wants to tell you. Let's talk about it. You gotta know. Here we are today, waiting to get to the preview of Guardians of the Galaxy. We have our pass holder confirmation form. We're heading in. This is the new Connections Cafe. Inside you can grab food and it's a really big Starbucks. Hey, we're getting checked in. All right, let's do it. So there it is. And today it is finally our turn to ride it. The ship in front of the Epcot ball just looks otherworldly. It has landed. There's our line in the front. There's the back of the ship. Guardians of the Galaxy Cosmic Rewind. Be aware that you will be transported to a Nova Cruiser orbiting above Terra for the demonstration. Take note, there is a 42 inch height requirement. Wonders of Xandar. From our world to yours. From our world to yours. Welcome to Terrans. Thank you. Check out the trash cans, even they're themed. Oh, look at this. Three sons. Xandar. This is cool. Check out this walkway. It winds all the way up and around. This queue can hold a lot of people. I hope you'll be able to hear me. Look how far it goes. We're going up in the lightning lane. Oh, there's the show. My purpose is to preserve the knowledge and history of Zandar. Your scholar, Peter Quill, has been teaching me about your world. He has suggested that if I want to start my journey of understanding the complex and intricate Terran mind, I should look no further than the sage words of a great Terran classic, Hooked on a Feeling. Ah! All right, so up to this point, we're doing pretty good. The outside with the ship was pretty neat. It's to scale, a lot like the Millennium Falcon. Um, going inside and checking the queue and everything was good. One of the things I would say is we did Lightning Lane and you miss a lot of the history of Xandar and the queue where they show you Walt Disney and he pops up as a hologram and they kind of compare it to Xandar as to Epcot and the futuristic world. But we got a little bit of that. You'll see it coming up, and then we get right on the ride. That's where the fun starts. Well, we're here inside the queue, waiting to get on the ride, waiting to see the history of Xandar behind us. Here we got Nova Corp headquarters. They're flying feet. It gives you a nice history as you're coming in. Rocket! And Groot. For you to travel to Xandar would take two and a half million years, assuming you had a ship that could fly at the speed of light. So we decided to come to you. But even we could not have reached you so easily. 
were it not for the Cosmic Generator, an advanced piece of Zandarian technology that creates jump points, artificial tunnels that act as shortcuts linking distant points in space. It is our desire to share this wondrous technology with your people so that together we might explore new worlds. ramp here this is the first peak you get of the ride vehicles so you get loaded two by two it's four people in a ride car We've gone backwards. We've spun around a whole bunch of times. This is not Harry Potter and the Lost Forbidden Ride where it's the same ride vehicle, but at a slower pace. You're moving at a rock and roller coaster pace in the spinning teacup inside a little bit brighter than Space Mountain. So picture Space Mountain spinning teacups as fast as rock and roller coaster could go. Here we go. This is where it starts.
that is an intense ride. We both, I couldn't film the whole thing. It moves, it is like Space Mountain to the extreme. So in conclusion, it is a pretty good ride. Um, I would say if you're someone like me and you know you get motion sickness, do not go on this ride. Motion sickness, seasickness, up and down. You can't go backwards. You can't spin around in circles. Just don't go. Watch the videos. Like, just don't go. We went for you so you don't have to. Uh, we got this nice little puke bag as a reminder. Uh, didn't get to fill it, but took it out as a souvenir. Um, in the NQ, they have these big trash cans with holes in them, not like the fancy trash cans in the front in the beginning of the video. So take heed. If you have motion sickness, don't go. But thanks for watching my family vacation guide. Please hit that subscribe button and like us. You'll help us out a lot. And we have a lot of good information to come in the future. Disney, Universal, cruises, trips. If you want info, stay tuned.